All right, Shabbat Shalom, Yash Allah, peace be into the nation of Israel, who are mighty day so called Negroes, Latinos, Native American Indians, the speck of our Israelites, some of the Israelite foreigners scattered across the four corners of the earth, including within America, Babylon, and Great, and with the Most High Yahweh's chosen people of the nation of Israel. So, without further ado, as always, just want to give all praises, glory, infinite honor to my power, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, who is the God of the living, Yahweh, Bahashem, Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai, Barach, Wadash, which is all praise to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. In the name of his only begotten and anointed son, you have a shy and holy spirit, who is our strength and our redeemer and our light and our salvation. With that, my shana kabawadim lahasequanium, shalak la wabakab, just double honors to the apostles and elders, great millstone, and true shepherds of Israel, pushing in sound doctrine and faith, truth and sincerity, and shalom, honors and salutations to Bayath Shadawada, the 144,000 elect governing body, the house of David, along with the rest of the one third elect men, women, and children of Israel. All right, this is your fellow servant, Malak Rayab, she's back at it again. Another lesson through the spirit of edification, exhortation, honor, and ratazah, which is the Lord willing within his lesson, uh, as well as within the spirit of prophecy, being a testimony of our Lord and Savior, Hamashiach and Habashai, whom the master of the world ignorantly referred to Jesus Christ. And just some breaking news uh, and regarding uh, another prophetic update of the judgment of the stars falling from heaven, all right, which is uh, 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 including the stars of this world, all right, which are these so called um, celebrities, all right, otherwise. Uh, biblically known as, uh, or, can, or can also be referred to as uh, men of renown, right, spoken about in the scriptures, which is really referring to the so-called Nephilim, or sons of God, all right, who were the original and authentic uh, sons of, of renown, all right, you know, the, the original people of fame being the, the, the sons of God, no exception, I mean, she just recently died um, following, uh, you know, following her being um, on a uh, life support, you know, being brain dead after a fiery car crash that happened in, in um in Los Angeles, man. All right. And now they, they recently removed her off of life support hours after it was reported that she was uh brain dead, okay, because she had, she has given up the ghosts. All right, because Heavenly Father Howe has claimed her soul. All right. Now she was at a so called big boys club, so to say. She was in the world. I mean she was in she was in that circle, that Hollywood circle, man. All right, that Hollowswood circle, man, which the word Holly, Hollowswood is a is a term of witchcraft, man. All right, that witches and warlocks use. So she was heavy in that in that uh, uh, congregation of Shatan sitting at his table, you know, spoken about in First Corinthians ten and twenty one and some of the precepts. And now she's in the spirit world. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and further uncover the spiritual, you know, component as to why I'm bringing this out. You know, what I'm saying uh, uh, um, regarding the breaking news of her death, you know. Because she was she was of the so-called wealthy ruling class, all right, that looked down on the poor. All right, I'm not afraid of going into that, but let me go ahead and bring this out. It says, U.S. actress Anne Hesch died after her life support was turned off a week after her fiery car crash in Los Angeles. The Daily Mail reported on Friday. All right. Now, um, let me go ahead and get this precept. This first precept in the book of St. Matthew Chapter 24, verse 29. All right, and it reads, Immediately after the tribulation of those days shall the sun be heaven, and the powers of the heaven shall be shaken. All right? You know, so the tribulation of these days, um, you know, prior to our Lord, Hamashiach, and Hashem's return into this realm to bring salvation upon um, the Israelites, the elective Israelites specifically, and damnation, okay, um, you know, the, and through the war that he would wage on the wicked, man, all right, through his fervent heat, spoke about in Second Peter, the third chapter, man, all right, and a part of these ensigns detonated in the process, uh, leaving that basement of destruction through that destroying wind spoken about how many waters, all right, you know, the, 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 um, the bloody city, okay, whose sins have reached the heavens, man, all right, all right, so this is, you know, so it's twofold. All right, going to the, to the stars from heaven, you know, falling mainly upon the, the sinful kingdom. That's also why um, we have this demon here. I'm going to bring this out real quick. Um, you know, this so-called uh, uh, OnlyFans slash Instagram model. All right, Courtney Taylor Clinney. All right, a 26-year-old Shedemite. All right, that that stabbed her, uh, got off scot free for for a minute, until they until they uh, until the court until the until the U.S. Marshals finally apprehended her apprehended her ass. 
Now they're saying it's not fair because they cooperate with police. But no, you do the crime, you do the time, man. Again, that's another insight that, you know, like it says in uh, St. Mark the 8th chapter, what profits that man if he, if he shall gain his way, you know? So going back to, to, the, uh, to this demon here, and Heshi, or Hesh, how you say her name, dying in a fiery car crash, which is terrible enough. Now, they say art imitates life, which is ironic for the fact that she was an actress right now. This is what I want to bring out through the spirit. I remember her from John Q, all right? Now, when you, when you watch this clip, okay, in this scene, she's, um, she's playing a health plant to keep their son alive. Because that's, that, that's, the, the, um, that's what the wish of John Q was, all right, to keep his son alive by transporting his, his heart over to his, you know, to, to his son, you know, which, or, or, or to find, in this case, to find a recipient, um, you know, with the same blood type uh, to uh, have, you know, you know what I'm saying, uh, that, you know, that was, you know, deceased, to have their hearts, their heart transferred uh, uh, over to his, uh, his son, okay, you know, because his son had heart problems. Now, another thing, now, that was, you know, she's being and she's being very pompous and very disingenuous and and merc and, and unmerciful in her uh, approach. Uh, the organ donor list, so to say, and she told him I thought that was very interesting. Now, okay, let me bring this out real quick. All right, uh, let me see. Uh, let me see where it's at. Now there was a there was a similar that now there was a report on her. Let me bring it out. That's a lucky. Let me let me just go back a little bit. Okay, so now there there is a report on her. Let me see if I can find it. I know on her supposedly uh, on her family offering to uh, or her her family ash you see you know because she was in the world you know and, and she's an eat my anyway she had no salvation but here's the point let me see if I can bring this out real quick let me see if I can find that article All right now I just seen it but um let me see uh. Salakia, let me see if I can find it real quick. He basically mentioned how her family was asking around if anyone needed organ or something like that, which is very interesting because, uh, you know, Tariq Nashi just did a, did a, uh, a sex and so forth, which is very interesting that she played a, she played a role in a movie where she, de she declined have, uh, the heart of an, of, a, of an organ donor, a deceased organ donor over to a son that needed another heart. Which is extreme anyway, you know. You know, because like how I said, let the dead bury the dead. But but nonetheless, ironically, being that art imitates life, now after her de after her her uh, her demise, her family was in that position. You know, I thought that was very interesting, man. You know, a lot of these Edomites just think that you know, especially these, these actors and actresses, they think if they just if they they if they're wicked. You know, if they're, uh, uh, you know, they, they play a wicked role in the movie, so that was just a movie. No, art, art imitates life, man. Okay? Like Samuel Jackson playing uh, Steven. He played the hell out of that role because that's that's his natural, because he was in his, his natural spirit playing that role. You see? You know? But nonetheless, you know, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and move on if I can't, if I can't find it. You know? But I just seen it, too, through the spirit. Um, well, let, let me, let me, let me jump down a little bit. Salaki. Let me jump down just a bit. Yup, right here, right here. Call on me, I'll buy Shimei Shai. You know, Shai Town trying to hide it from me, but hey, the spirit prevails. Anyway, it says, Anne Hesh is brain dead, but remains on life support for organ donation. According to family statement, see? Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Right now, in this movie, <laughs> that's cold, man. The Heavenly Father is cold, man. The Heavenly Father Yahweh is cold, all right, in a good way. Now, she played a role 
where she declined a Jake family the opportunity for uh, organ donation for the sake of her son to live for a heart transplant. But she was only kept on life support in case someone needed organs and whatnot. Okay? You know? And really, we already know what, what the use of those organs would have been for, but that's, that's due to spirit. Okay? So I'm going to get this precept, you know, because she was a she was a, a carnal she was a wealthy uh, individual on a carnal in a carnal aspect, right? So we're going to get this pre this next precept in the book of Ecclesiastes or Sirach, chapter thirteen, verse twenty one, and it reads. A rich man beginning to fall is held up of his friends, but a poor man being down is thrust all, also away by his friends. Right? Meaning what? If, you, if you're a wealthy person and poor is separated from his neighbor. You see? So where were all these wealthy friends uh, uh, to, to help her in a time of need? They couldn't help her even if they wanted to because it's a terrible thing to fall within the hands of Yahweh by Shemeshai. So that's, 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 that's more spiritual layers of the situation because when we're out here, when we're out in the highways and hedges... You know, you know, especially for, you know, Akim such as myself that don't have any other Akim in the camp or very minimum Akim in the camp. People say, or, or you know, uh, 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 on the other side of the spectrum, more importantly, you know, there, there won't be anyone visibly seen listening to us. And the people will use that to, uh, you know, further, uh, 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 you know, demean and discount our message, which is the gospel uh, uh, to the saints that the kingdom of heaven is coming. And they'll say they'll, they'll spew things like uh, they'll utter things out of the mouth, like uh, uh, you know, insolent statements out of the Freemasonic suit. All right, with shaved faces and pale skin. You know what I'm saying? One would beg to differ that we would have a we would generate a large crowd, and that's why that goes into why the Heavenly Father Howard said what I would make the fool I would I would I would use the foolish things to confound the wise things because why the the wisdom knowledge understanding of this world is foolishness to the Most High Man. Okay, you know, science, technology, religion. All right. You know, the foreign policy, those like the Academy and the, the Academy Awards and the Oscars and so forth, in which uh, the, the elder Apostle Tahar further uh, exposed the fact that, uh, um, you know, Oscar, that the Oscars goes back to a, a, a god they were worshiping known as uh, Ta, I believe it is, uh, spelled P-T-A-H, you know, because everything has an origin, there's nothing new under the sun, you know. So these people indulge in a life of, of, of they're, they're indulging this, in this worldly life. And a friend of this world is enemy to the Lord, which means what? Their, their life, all right, it, it has an expiration, done, an expiration date on it, man. Now, ironically, she made that movie, she was in that movie in 2002 when it came out, being very pompous and disingenuous. And you could tell she was in her natural spirit playing that role, okay? You know, being in a position of uh, authority in, in, in a carnally wealthy uh, 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 aspect. You know, speaking down on a, on a poor Jake family, you know, mocking them that lives in a certain aspect, you know, and especially within the within the concern of, of avoiding death. But now she was in that situation. I thought that was very spiritual, man. All right. You know, so going back to this, going back to the uh, to the scripture, um, so, uh, this is uh, Sirach 13 and 21. A rich man beginning to fall is held up of his friends, but a poor man being down is thrust also away by his friends. When a rich man is fallen, he had many helpers. He speaketh things not to be spoken, and yet men justify him. The poor man slipped, and yet they rebuked him too. He spake wisely and kept, and could have no place. Now, real quick, let me get this precept. Proverbs 22 and 22. All right? Proverbs 22 and 22. All right, and it reads, Rob not the poor because he is poor, neither oppress the afflicted in the gates. And that's exactly what she imitated in his movie. Because it wasn't just a movie to her, okay? These people take on these roles because they relate to the character. Why does she relate to that character that she played, right? Because she has perpetual hatred, okay, towards the towards the actors that 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 that, that imitate the people that she hates, and that's the the, the descendants of uh, Jacob, so-called black and indigenous people, uh, and and specifically the so-called blacks in the case of this movie, okay? All right, and now. She wound, she's, she wound up in a, in a similar situation, a similar, all right, to have that sentiment in mind, okay? Being, being, uh, 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 being uh, uh, of that ruling class, okay, over the poor that is subject to the, to the, uh, to the rich, the carnally rich, 
Okay. So what were her friends to help her? Matter of fact, we get that scripture. Okay. What were her friends to help her with with uh, organ uh, uh, harvesting and whatnot? Okay. You know, uh, organ uh, donor uh, 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 um, transplanting and such to attempt to keep her alive. There was nothing they can do. You see. But yet, in 2 Timothy, the third chapter, one of the ending prophecies is that men would be bolstered to themselves, being that they would be of their own God, okay? Do, uh, 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 do, uh, what, what's it called, man? Um, it's on the tip of my tongue. It's a technological term, all right? Um, it escapes my mind. But anyway, but let me go ahead and get this precept. This is uh, Sirach chapter 6. Sirach chapter 6, let me jump down to verse... Um, start of verse 16, and from thy youth up, so shalt thou find wisdom to thine old age. All right. So, so a, a real friend is a friend that's willing to die. All right. For, for those, uh, 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 um, you know, uh, for the, for, for his friend. All right. Cause we know, like it says in Proverbs 17 and 17, other similar precepts, you know, a brother, you know, a true, a, a, a friend. All right, you know, we'll stick closer. Uh, 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 we'll stick closer as a brother, or closer than like an actual brother. Roughly paraphrased, and like how Shah said, uh, uh, they have uh, how he was he he was uh, sent down here to lay his life down for his friends. And who the friends be held by Shimon Shai? Those who were to do his will, man. Like it says in the Book of Saint John, you know. And these people of the world are, are actually friends uh, of of, of uh, Shatan, okay, for doing his bidding, okay. I say, like it says in St. James the fourth chapter, they're friends of this world. All right. And they don't and, and, and that's why they govern themselves off of their flesh. And that's why a lot of these celebrities, okay, aka stars of of, of you know so called stars of heaven, all right, um, you know, are into all kinds of uh you know, decadent, uh, perverse behavior. In which the word decadence goes back to the word decaying, meaning dying, because because of way because they're the ways of, of, of their living is not of living, it's a, is of death. Because they made that covenant with death, like it says in Isaiah the twenty eighth chapter, you know, like indulging in sexually illicit activities, which is which is forbidden, okay, by the laws of marriage. If you how about Shemesh Shai, all right, and they indulge in uh, uh, orgies, all right, they were heavily involved in, okay, and heavily prevalent, which was which was heavily prevalent in the pagan Greco Roman Empire, all right, going back to ancient Babylon, all right, when they indulge in that kind of madness as a further oath to the pagan uh, gods. You know, it was a, a wicked satanic sacrifice, you know, of the little book that we were to take and, and, and eat, like it says in Revelation 10 chapter, all right? That would be bitter, it would be sweet like honey, but bitter in our stomachs, meaning what? We, we would be, we, we, we would be, uh, uh, you know, we would be, uh, you know, we would be chastised by the Heavenly Father, all right? You know, by, by uh, through our process, our purging process, all right, from the affairs of this life that we've been so so uh, associated with, all right, to further uh, appease our flesh, to validate the world, and especially those who rule the, the rulers of the darkness that rules the world, all right? And as a further result of that, we would be ridiculed and persecuted by people who are friends of the world, you know? And that's that art that she further imitated in that movie, all right? You know, because everything is spiritual, man. And so what were her friends to help her? What, where, was her where was her true friend? All right, to 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 uh, bring her instruction. All right, there wasn't no such there wasn't no such friend because that was not of her lot. She was not she was not it was not of her lot to receive this righteous instruction. All right, because she's an Edomite, and there's no salvation for you Edomites, and that's why you're being exposed at the wazoo in every aspect of really your religion, politics, you know, finances of economics, okay, and, and how you're afraid of defrauding people through uh you know increased uh. uh you know, spiked taxes, you know, or tax spikes rather on behalf of the Fed against the poor, Fed of defrauding the poor, which is a which is of a, a, a of a bloody intention. Okay, another another method of warfare. And that's what she represented in that movie role that she as a health administrator further uh, uh, you know um you know you know further imitated what her role was, man, what her lot was anyway. I had to be another minister of Shatan. And she's completely irrelevant, some actress but everything is spiritual because there's two sides in war, you know, and these Edomites are obviously on the left hand side, you know, now she's in the spirit world, man, you know, 
So I'm going to get, you know, so where are her wealthy friends to help her in a time of uh, in a time of need? There's nothing they could do. And this is why. Hebrews chapter 10, verse 31. It is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power. Yahweh. See? There's no, hey, there's, there, like it says in scripture, no, no man can pluck, can pluck thee out of thy hands. Matter of fact, let me see if I can, let me see if I can bring that out real quick. You can see if I can bring that out real quick. Um, Salakia. Uh, I thought that was, let me see, man. Um, I think it's, let me see. This is St. John 10 and 28, and this is really dealing with the elect. And I gave unto them eternal life, and they shall never perish, neither shall any pluck them out of my hand. And that's the elect. Otherwise, um, you know, you'd be out here to fend for yourself. Meaning what? You would have no holy covering in the time of tribulation and, and, and you know, and, and distress, especially in a, in a time that we're living in, man, where resources are being purposely exacerbated, exacerbated rather by the rulers of the darkness of this world. And now even these celebrities are starting to feel it. As a matter of fact, I, I ran into uh, one of these, the newscasters, down here in the Albertsons. You know, I started to say something funny. Like, what are you, what are you doing in the Albertsons with well, his little folk? I thought you're supposed to be in Whole Foods somewhere. You know, she's sh she shopping in Albertsons. Cleavage y'all out. Because these people are starting to feel it, man. You know? Because we're in this paradigm shift right now. And it's very spiritual what's happening right now. Okay, the, 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 the you know, the paradigm shift from the, wealth, from the carnally wealthy to the spiritually wealthy. Because our spiritual wealth is, manif is manifesting before our very eyes, man. All right? Because we're, we're, you know, pursuing a Sirach 10 and 8, how riches were gotten deceitfully. Uh, next precept in the book of 2nd Ezra, chapter 9, verse 22. And it reads, ultimately, pursuing a Revelation 13 3, being drunk off the wine of fornication of Babylon the Great, all right, on his hit list. And she was one of them, man. That was a terrible death she went through. And she was a woman. But I got, like it says in Acts 10, chapter, the Heavenly Father. Is not respected of of uh, he's not respected persons, and that's why the uh, 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 plantation, uh, um, you know, Christian, you know, uh, 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 Christians, you know, what I'm saying, uh, 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 have in the Most High. He's a happy-go-lucky uh, power. No man, that that would be of a false balance. He's terrible, in in, in in his doings. For with great labor have I made it perfect, and that grape is of his elect, the first fruits. Okay, and everyone else's lives are numbered, man. All right. So, like it says in Zephaniah 3 and 19, let me go ahead and end it off there. Okay? On, on which manner people was to be appointed uh, true fame, appointed by the Heavenly Father, bestowed upon by the Heavenly Father, because there, there, there is ultimate glory in, in that manner of fame as opposed to the fame of this world. So, you know, we, you know, you know what I'm saying? You know, so, you know, in the, if you had certain brothers that were in the entertainment industry, actors, you know, uh, musicians, you know, athletes, like the elder brother. Um, from uh, Charlotte, you know, you know, but hey, man, we we can't we uh, we unconform for this world because we understand the things of this world are foolishness to the Lord because it's of the wisdom not your understanding, uh, considered sensual and devilish by those whose wicked hands the earth was given to, and that's ultimately Edomites, right? these so-called Caucasians. Now they're being further confounded. Why? Because their uh, their uh, beloved American Empire, Babylon the Great, is a sinking ship. Okay. So I'm going to uh, end this off here in the book of uh, Zephaniah, chapter 3, verse 19. It reads, Behold, as video, she prays for the edifying resort to the